In this mathcast, we show how to use the geography function function to create a function defined and drawn only on a specific interval. That is, we wish to define the restriction of a function. So we're going to use tangent for our function. Let's first define the entire tangent function. So we click down in the input bar and we type tangent and because that's a math function, not a geography function, it gets parentheses of x. And we hit enter, we get the entire tangent function defined on its entire domain. Now, what we want to do is just get this one branch of tangent of x. In geography, trigonometric functions are always radians. So these are radians down here. So why don't we change them to radian units? So we right click in any blank space on the drawing pad, right click, select drawing pad. We have the x axis here, we go to distance and we select pi over 2. Now they at least look like radians. Okay, so what we want to do is define tangent of x but only between minus pi halves and plus pi halves. Let's hide this for a moment and go down to the input bar again and now we type function we can use a capital or a small letter automatically geographer will find it so we start typing fu and it's found it we take our arrow key go between the brackets we have three parameters the function the left end of the interval and the right end of the interval so the function is again tangent and with a parenthesis x and then the left side was minus pi halves. We can use the symbol pi from here, or we can just type pi over 2. And then another comma, and then plus pi over 2. We hit enter, and we get only the one branch of tangent, and it automatically gets the next letter in line, which is g of x. So g of x is the restriction of tangent, to the interval minus pi halves plus pi halves. Now we mention that if you use g of x in any calculation, it will automatically work on the entire domain. So if we were to click down here in the input bar again and type h of x equal to m minus g of x, we're going to get everything. Okay, let's take that away. This is what we have. So, g of x is tangent of x on the interval minus pi halves to plus pi halves.